Hey there, Bobby Hoyt here, founder and CEO of Millennial Money Man. Today, we're gonna to be talking about one of my favorite things to talk about, side hustles. Side hustles helped me pay off $40,000 in student loan debt in 18 months, also quit my full-time teaching job, and I've since grown my side hustle into a multi-seven-figure online business. So if you're looking to earn some extra cash, diversify your income streams, or maybe even leave your day job one day, you're in the right place. In this video, I'll be sharing our top side hustles that can help you boost your income. Let's go ahead and dive in. First up is digital marketing. So digital marketing is booming and it presents a fantastic opportunity for a side hustle. And it's really the first one that I started with uh, all the way back in 2015 when I started online. So running Facebook and Instagram ads is one of the easiest ways to start for beginners. And you can make $1,000 to $2,000 per month per client offering digital marketing services to businesses and entrepreneurs. You're helping them build their online presence, attract more customers, and, and drive sales. And it's really just a win-win for everyone involved. And it's one of the easiest entry points for somebody that's looking to get into the online world because you're helping other people make money. So check out below how to find more information about starting this side hustle and the rest that I'm gonna mention in this video. Okay, on to the next one, online surveys. And I just wanna put a quick disclaimer here. You're not gonna get rich doing, doing surveys. You're not even gonna get close to getting rich. This is just for people that like to play Candy Crush or you like to play like Wordle or whatever. You like to just scroll around on your phone and you wanna make some extra money doing that instead. Surveys are the way to do that, but it's not something that's gonna make you thousands and thousands of dollars a month. This is just for a little bit of extra money in your spare time, but it's really, really easy. Many companies and market research firms conduct surveys to gather valuable consumer insights. That means that you can give your opinion and make money for it. So you can sign up with survey platforms or market research companies and start taking surveys in your spare time. You're gonna be making about a dollar to three dollars per survey. Uh, but at the end of the day, it's a fun and really easy way to earn a little bit of extra cash if you're somebody that likes to just scroll on your phone anyway. Now for anyone who's organized and really good with numbers, pay attention to this next one. Consider offering bookkeeping services as a side hustle. Many small businesses and freelancers need help with managing their finances. You can assist them with tasks like invoicing and expense tracking and reconciling accounts. This is an excellent side hustle for anyone who wants to work remotely from home or while they travel and you can make around 500 bucks per client with just a few hours of work each month. And I'll tell you, this is something like I have a bookkeeper, all of my online business friends have bookkeepers, all of the, the physical location business owners I know have bookkeepers. It's a really, really in-demand skill. And it's one of those things that's just, there's not a ton of people that are great at it. And you can be one of those people that's charging $500 per month or more. It's an absolutely fantastic side hustle that you should look into. Next up, we have freelance writing. If you have a way with words and you love to write, this side hustle is perfect for you, even in the era of AI. Uh, there's still plenty of opportunities out there for freelance writers. And the deal is that many businesses and websites are willing to pay for high quality content and I actually hire freelance writers to work for me on, on all of the different projects that I have going on. So I know that there is definitely a need for good quality content and great writers. Uh, you can put your skills to use and start earning by creating articles or blog posts or even social media content. And it's just one of those things that even as technology emerges, there's still gonna be a lot of opportunity for people that are really, really good at putting good content together. And that brings me to the next one that's another really good side hustle for anyone that's good with words and it's proofreading. So like, if you're like me at all, you're not always the best with grammar and punctuation and you need someone to help publish error-free content and that's exactly what proofreaders do. And they edit what bloggers and entrepreneurs and freelance writers and academics and other types of professions and business owners write and they correct any spelling or punctuation uh, and grammar errors before the content's published. So there's a lot of different uses for a proofreader. There's a lot of different applications. There's a lot of different people that need this type of work and they need a person that understands context and understands what they're trying to do and, and just nuance, right? And that's the big thing that even with tools like Grammarly, like there's not a lot of nuance, right? So you need a person that understands the nuance that goes along with some of these pieces that are, that are written and need to be proofread. All you're doing is helping people create professional looking content and the deal is that proofreaders can make anywhere from $500 to $2,000 per month working for their clients. So it's a great, great side hustle. Now, our next side hustle is food delivery driving. And this is one of the most flexible options in this video. And again, kind of like surveys. I mean, you're going to make way more than you would make doing surveys. But you're not going to get rich doing this. But that's not the point. The point is to just have a reliable, flexible way to make some money in your spare time when you need it. So if you have a reliable vehicle and you have some spare time, why not sign up? It's just like you're just driving to restaurants and you're driving to people's door. You don't even have to talk to people. Drivers average anywhere from $15 to $25 an hour. And with the rise of online shopping and food delivery services, there is definitely a high demand for drivers. We talk to these companies all the time here at Millennial Money Man, 
and they're always asking us to send them drivers. So there's a lot of opportunity out there. Uh, you can work for popular delivery apps or even partner with local businesses to offer delivery services in your area. I actually just had a bunch of meal prep meals delivered to my door by like a teenager the other day. And if he's making the money, why don't you make the money instead? Next up is offering cleaning services. So cleaning services are always in demand. You can offer residential or commercial cleaning services depending on your preference. Whether it's regular maintenance or deep cleaning, people are often willing to pay for a spotless space and running a cleaning side hustle can bring in around $20 to $40 per hour. You start small, you advertise in your area, you build a good reputation, and you watch your client base grow. And that's exactly what happens in my neighborhood. We pay for cleaners and we refer them to people all the time. And all I have to do is ask, you know, hey, do any of your neighbors want a, a good cleaning service? And then anytime I talk to one of my neighbors, I'm like, hey, these people are awesome. You should do it too. So it's really, really a good way uh, to build up your business. And there's just a lot of opportunity out there. It's a lot of houses, a lot of spaces, right? So there you have it. It's our top seven side hustles to boost your income. The key to making any side hustle work is putting the effort and the time it takes to actually start making extra money. If it was super easy, everybody would be doing it. Everybody would just have all this extra side hustle money just flowing in, but you have to actually go out and start something. But there's a lot of options. Hopefully you got some inspiration today. There's super easy stuff that's not gonna make you a bunch of money like, like uh, surveys. And then there's stuff that's gonna make you $2,000 plus per month if you're doing something like digital marketing. So just pick a side hustle that aligns with your interests and start hustling. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, click the thumbs up and check out the video description below for more information and where you can find us online. And just between you and me, I'm trying to get more views than Ariel, who's our head of content here at Millennial Money Man. So please share this video, help me out. I don't need her getting more views than me, even though she is awesome. So anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching. See you soon.